Hey girls, happy holidays. Today is Tuesday, December 17th, and we are here for another Try On Tuesday. A little bit of housekeeping. I decided since next Tuesday is Christmas Eve, and then the Tuesday after that is New Year's Eve, I'm gonna take a little break. Don't kill me, okay? So Try On Tuesday, this is our last one for 2019, and then we will be back um after the new year so we'll have lots of fun stuff in between for the next few weeks so don't tune out but just so you know we'll be back for fresh try-ons after the new year so today i'm really excited for the pieces that we selected as always make sure that you comment back let us know every week we edit it and put it on youtube too so you can always see past weeks and without further ado so last week we started featuring dresses with the trend towards timeless, clean, um, just very simplistic. And so this is another one of those gowns. As soon as I saw that it had arrived, I was so excited. This is Martina Liana 1235 in um, ivory, also comes in white, and it is a stretch crepe, very comfortable. Also comes with this detachable crepe belt. Now what I love about this one in particular for us is a lot of our crepe gowns come in a bridal size 10, 12, which is like a six, eight. This gown we got in a sample size 14, which I am so excited about. So for me, it's a little too big. I have it clipped in the back, but a bridal size 14 is more like a street size 10. So even if you're a little bigger than that, you're gonna be able to try this on and really see it. I have it clipped, like I said, so you can kind of see how it would fit a little bit tighter, but I love this neckline. It's a very, like I said, very sort of timeless, easy, and I'll show you how you can jazz it up as well. See here that I just jazzed it up with a very simple belt. Now the thing about belts is that you, if you choose a belt, your seamstress is gonna tack it down, so it's never gonna move. But what's nice is because it has this crepe belt, you could actually attach a very skinny belt right to that, or you could do a thicker belt too, but I think with this look, something simple simplistic is good. And then I just paired it with a very simple, simple Bel Air um, veil fingertip lengths with this beautiful, um, a little bit of shimmer. So just to match. So again, keeping it timeless and beautiful, but giving it a little more sparkle. Going in a completely different direction. This is brand new from All Who Wander. This is Ziggy. I love the names of their dresses. So this is an A-line dress. It's got this beautiful V-neck with this um, lovely little sheer bodice and appliques. You see the florals, the 3D florals, a little bit of sparkle. Really love, almost like a floral belt that is built into it. Um, and then it is basically two layers. So underneath, this is the ivory over champagne. It also comes in all ivory but you'll see the champagne underneath so this is more of the fitted a fitted piece underneath with beautiful um, applique which I'll show you closer in a second and then chiffon that overlays and yes you can see there is a little slit so it's got a little bit of sassiness wait till you see the back also that is a showstopper how pretty is this? So it's completely exposed. There's no netting, but I just love how it meets in the middle. It is a button here, so it actually closes a little bit more than I have it, but it's got the 3D florals, a little bit of sparkle, and then I love that they continued the florals on the back, and then you see the beautiful chiffon skirt. So excited that this gown came in this week so that I could try it um, before we take a break. So this is new from Paloma Blanca. This is number 4889 in natural. We have the bridal size 12. Um, it was a little big on me, so I did cinch it in at the waist. But oh, this is funny because if you've been watching for any length of time, you girls know I love sparkle and glitter and anything shiny. But I am just loving these timeless gowns lately. You guys let me know what you think. But this is a satin gown, nice low V-neck. I love the cut the top. I just think it's so beautiful. It does have an attached belt as well, so it's nice that that is built in. And then this organza overskirt is just so beautiful. And wait till you see the back, the way that the train goes is so pretty. You're just gonna love it. 
So again, I have it cinched in here, so don't mind this little creasing here, but it's got this beautiful little crystal on the top that it buttons, this nice little slit back. So it's a nice high back, which is so beautiful. And then this is the lightest skirt ever, this organza overskirt, and you'll see the horsehair trim on the bottom as well. Just to make sure I still like Sparkle, wanted to try this one on for you, brand new from Essence of Australia, D2939. Let me make sure that is correct. I always forget. 2939 in ivory over Moscato. Also comes in all ivory or all white and is available in regular and extended sizes. So two through 30. This is a gorgeous, um, obviously long sleeve dress. I love the sheerness of the sleeves with the appliques. It's falling off my shoulder a little bit because I don't have it fully buttoned in the back, but I really like the scoop of the top. I feel like it's really flattering. Waist is nice and cinched in, nice and small. And look at the gorgeous appliques. So appliques, we have um, clear sequins that gives it a little bit of the shimmer. And then a sequin, um, not sequin, excuse me, a glitter under layer. So that gives it a little bit of extra shimmer as you move. Wanted to show you the back as well. Now, just as a reminder, so I couldn't get it to zip up all the way. This is a bridal size 10. I am a street size 6'8". If there was someone helping me, I'm sure they could zip this up, but that just shows you, I mean, this is tight on me. This would probably fit, but it's a 10 and I'm a 6'8". So just remember that as you're trying on. But I love how the sleeves come down towards the back, this nice V neck with the appliques, and then a beautiful train, the appliques continue. It's just a gorgeous gown. Last dress of the day, our last dress of 2019. Whoops, stepping on it. I am obsessed. This is from Essence of Australia, D2761 in ivory, also comes in white. And girls, if you have not felt dove satin before, <clears throat> excuse me, um, you need to. It is butter. Anyone who's been here when I have a girl trying on one of these dresses, I'm like, butta. That's all I can say. And guess what? Pockets. Are we obsessed with this neckline? First of all, the low V in itself is gorgeous. The off the shoulder, gorgeous. But I love the little cuff, like the little collar here. I just think that is so cute. It continues on the back, so I'll show you. Buttons all the way down the train. It is very light. It is so comfortable. It is so again, this is a bridal, I think it's a 14, so it's definitely big on me, but I just wanted you to see the back, how it cuffs on the back as well, the little fold here. I just, whoop, and I'm gonna break our mirror. Um, I just love how that little detail, and then look at the buttons, hopefully you can see them all the way down. Well, girls, we hope you enjoyed today's Tuesday try-on and all of the try-ons that we've done over the last few months. We, again, are going to be taking a break for the rest of 2019. We will see you back in 2020. We want to know, comment below your favorites, what you love, what you don't love, what you'd love to see more of in 2020. These videos are here for you girls. So we want to wish you um, from myself and everyone here at Bliss a Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, Happy Hanukkah. And if you're getting engaged this season, we can't wait to see you as a bride for our 2020-2021 season. Merry Christmas.